A new company setting up shop in Spartanburg County. As our Henry Coburn explains, a fast-growing beverage brand celebrated their growth with some new jobs. Milo's Tea Company today broke ground on its new distribution and manufacturing center here in Spartanburg. The plant represents a massive investment and 100 new jobs for upstate workers. Sweet tea and lemonade from Alabama will soon be produced right here in Spartanburg County. On behalf of Spartanburg County Council, it is my honor and privilege to be representing the 345,000 people in our county in welcoming Milo T to part of the Spartanburg family. When all is said and done, the $130 million plant will take up 110,000 square feet on the corner of US 221 and SC 290. Today's groundbreaking ceremony included comments from local and state leaders, none of whom said they were surprised that another large company is setting up shop here in the upstate. There's something about the people of South Carolina that these businesses from around the world like, and they want to come to South Carolina, invest hundreds of millions and even billions of dollars, and let South Carolinians do that work for them and make that company grow. And as the company gets ready to hire 100 upstate workers to fill roles in the upcoming plant, CEO Tricia Walwork is promising good culture and good benefits. We are going to invest in great benefits, um, best in market pay, and you know, uniquely we pay 100% of our employer, our family health insurance coverage uh, for our associates, which is very unique, and we're going to offer um, best in class benefits. Milo's Tea Company says it will begin hiring for the jobs at this plant in spring of 2024. The plant itself will open in the fall of that year. For now in Spartanburg, Henry Coburn, 7 News. A tea made in Spartanburg will be shipped all over the eastern United States.